Hello, hello, lads and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of GTA. Okay, time to pull up this house. Heist? <laughs> Sorry, I can't speak today. Uh, I promised this in the last episode that I would do it in this episode, so here it is. <clears throat> Breaking into the FIB building. Hey! How you doing? Ah, pretty good, under the circumstances. Oh, Lester. About to knock off a federal government building. Oh, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. If Franklin got us what we need, put those on. Then what? Then mm -hmm. head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. So. I'm guessing drapes and scented candle aren't going to do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. We'll have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get Ooh, out, he's going to burn up bombs, this place. Meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well, under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck <laughs> you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. Say bye to the place. Soon this place is gonna go up in flames. Okay, I'm gonna take my sexy car that I stole. <laughs> have some, um, I think it was a Latina guy, La Latino, yeah, Latina is girl, right, <laughs> Latino guy, Con Mr. Clinton. Mike, we doing this? Yeah, real soon, Frank. Pick up the fire truck and RV with Gus Moda and Daryl Johns. I'll give you word when I'm out of the bureau. I got oh, it, dog. skills. At least we can count on these guys <laughs> in a pinch. Yeah, that's good. We need guys we can count though. Ooh. Your car is the shit so I know. The <laughs> uh, but you wanna have brandis slick. Oh god. Uh okay, all jokes aside. For the last time, uh, time to do some dirty work. Uh sorry. Look, I'm having a bad day. Sorry. Is it your first day? Go through the turnstile and head up. Okay. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. Ooh. Uh. Maybe that's not the best thing to say. Going into the elevator. Yeah, some um, there <laughs> uh, on your farm. Okay, maintenance bucket and a mop. <sighs> I'm mopping the floor. Uh huh. Okay. So, ah, shit. Okay. Clean that off. First time mopping up. Uh, 
let's just hide a bomb in here. There you go. Nothing suspicious. Ain't I on a timer here to mop the floors? Or I thought Trevor said something about the er mm, Trevor, um I mean um Lester. Lester is the name of Okay. I think I can do two spots at least, right? Ah, dirty. Nope. Okay, good to know. So after one spot, do some cleaning. Oh, well, let's bring this thing along, shall we? Why does it show... I can see no dirty spot here. It's gone now at least. Okay, that was weird. Uh, now at least I should be able to pick this up. Yeah. Ah, uh, kind of sucks that I can't sprint in here. Look at them phases. So, Mike, how does it feel to do an honest day's work? Pretty horrible, right? Okay. Um, I think I should pick this up. Oh, I can't pick it up. Okay. Hey, wait till I shake it off before you mop the floor. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Yep. Oh, on the toilet. Pick up the book, good. This isn't my strong suit, like doing an honest day's work. I mean, I'm an effing criminal. Another janitor? Was the last one a heart attack or a budget cut? <laughs> when are you gonna get out of here? When I log my OT for the week. Yeah, it's not about being effective, it's about. <sighs> Wine, wine, wine. Unless they're called Michael wine the pants. Okay, time to go down. Okay. Leave the building. Yeah, the floors are mopped, guys. They don't work so hard. We're all leaving in a minute. That's when the bombs goes off. Not when I heard too many of you. Now I can't really sprint. Great. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Look at the fire truck. Right around the corner, we got your gear in here with us. 
shit's in motion, people. We raiding the bureau. Y'all ready for this? In and out, Holmes. Let's do it. Okay. My folks jumping in. All right, trigger the fire bombs, Frank. I'll get my turnout gear on. Okay. Use the phone. Uh. Detonate. <laughs> Look at that firework. Look at it. <laughs> and up she goes. Let's get there. Me rare. <laughs> Sorry, so people. I'm in a hurry. Signal, right? Yep. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess. So don't worry. We need to hurry there. It's fire. It's a fire. 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 Pull up over here. In the building. Come on. Hey, come on. Don't get stuck in the door. You need to evacuate the building. <laughs> yeah, let's use the elevators. Alright, Lester says these elevators should still be fine. Whether you want an industrial strip painkillers or that hallucinatory weed at the time. Yeah, probably a little bit of both. Cool, dog. Thanks for clearing that shit up. All right, we're going across to the far stairwell and up to the top floor. We gotta go across. Take the stairs to the top floor. Okay. We take these up six stories. Come on. The rooms are 53. Not much further. Let's punch it. Oh, he said 63, right? Fifty-three. Containment drives up here. Ah, fifty-three. Okay. Come on now, dudes. What are you all waiting for? <laughs> Cause it sure the heck ain't me. Will that do? I got the drive, let's go! It's collapsing! Oh shoot! It's coming down! Why did, did it have to stop me but no one else? I bet if I was Michael there it would have stopped me too. Come on! Okay, cutscene. Yeah, and now standing still for a moment. Just to make sure they get away. Oh no. I hear fire behind there. There goes that dude. Is he still breathing? Ah oh, shit, man, he's dead. We can't take a corpse through this inferno. We gotta leave him. Let's go. Oh god. This sure as heck is an inferno. Damn, it's falling apart! On me! On me! Okay, follow our great leader. Mikhail. Oh. Did I die? No. Oh, man. Kind of. That explosion must have knocked me out, man. Oh. Good thing I brought out a weapon, apparently. Any more of those? Shit and give it up. 
I can't even see through this. I thought I heard one more gun. Maybe not. Oh! Hmm. Yeah, you shouldn't be here. Can't you see there is a fire? Uh. Okay. Oh god. Okay. Now it's a bit clearer. Okay. Hey, we're going over this. Follow me. Uh, are you guys serious right now? We're going up again to get down. Apparently. Plans show an elevator shaft this way. We can repel to the bottom. Oh, so we're gonna like jump the elevator? Okay. My turn. Okay. S to repel and... Oh, shoot. Sure, I'm lucky it did that. Okay, I'm down. Okay. I wonder, will people like be suspicious about us now? I mean. We do look like firemen. And there's nothing suspicious about firemen going around uh, when it's a uh, house on fire, right? Yeah. There was nothing we can do. We're okay, sorry. We Okay, no one saw that. Good thing. We need to get to the right and torch this fire truck as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute they'll be looking for me. I mean, those guys in the building. Calm down, Michael. Calm down. Breathe. It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Trust me. I'm going to get us there as fast as I can. All right, shit. Shit. I just don't want to run into something. Man, y'all don't want to run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't want to run into. <laughs> You're right. So, uh, take us to our get out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. Alright, man, I'll try. <laughs> try real hard, uh... okay? How far to the getaway car? The fire truck can't go much quicker. Calm down, Mikey. Calm down. You're in good hands. Frank, you know how to drive a car. Leave the fire truck. And now to destroy it. Shit! Okay, get away from it. I feel a whole lot better. Take us to Lester's. Yeah, get in the car, boys. 
Too bad there's only three of us. But now I mean, clear, I can probably tell you people. I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a duel, man. Oh yeah, shit. I don't like speaking ill of the departed, know what I'm saying? But that dude was in over his head. Yeah, he wasn't top draw, but I thought we could carry him through it. I guess I thought wrong. Well, anyway, we made it out. So we got that to be thankful for. Mm -hmm. Daryl's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Hey, man, it was our fault Daryl went down. Really? Why's that? Didn't you speak to the guy? Nothing was his fault, so it, uh, it must have been us, right? Ah, uh, <laughs> I'll put it down to bad leadership then. I can tell you that, because the leader was dumb enough to take you in there. True that. Yeah, but still, I heard the fire going off in there. It was pretty clear that he shouldn't have done that. I mean, I'm no fire expert, but even I could tell that. But I guess he thought that it was only some sparkling fire from the bombs. It shouldn't do anything if they open the door. I mean, I mean, we was in kind of a hurry, so maybe he didn't think straight. Too bad he died, though. I mean, we got a crew bonus of twenty-five percent. So this crew would have been better, so he could have done a whole lot better for us in the next heist. Oh well. Uh, okay, we're getting close to Garmin Factory. Or, wait, we're not going to the Garmin Factory. Hey, let's the place up here. Oh, we're going to Lester's house. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're torched to Garmin Factory. Your head's down, you hear? <laughs> he looks well, angry. What? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! <laughs> oh God, he's good. How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, give me oh, some of that. Hey, ow, ah, ow, ow, ow. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine. Oh, time shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. <laughs> I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm oh. ill, okay? Give me a break. Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> Too strong for you? <laughs> Alright boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I gotta go square oh, things laughs. up with Davey and Dick Wild. For serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. Incest <laughs> <laughs> <Just> juice. <laughs> Boy, show know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis. <laughs> Government games. Oh, sweet, sweet Jesus. That was awesome. <laughs> Okay, there doesn't seem to be any quest at the moment, I guess. I'm gonna get something soon. But, I think I'm gonna end off the episode here. I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> okay, there we go. Calling Davey. We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather repeatedly 
It doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, so there we got a new quest, and then we know what to do in the next episode. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this one, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.